In a unanimous decision at yesterday's Logan County Fiscal Court meeting, the county is set to purchase 241 acres from h, &H Sheet Metal for the construction of a new county park. WBK reporter William Battle went to Logan, Logan County today to talk about this big decision. After years of planning, Logan County Fiscal Court is set to purchase 241 acres to construct a new county park with a unanimous decision during yesterday's meeting. A thriving and healthy community uh, benefits from the parks. It's good for our physical health, it is good for our mental health, and it drives economic development to your community. So it is healthy for a thriving community to have a thriving park system. Spearheaded by 6th District Magistrate Thomas Bolden, the land will be purchased from H&H &H Sheet Metal. We want to put in bike trails, hiking trails, walking trails. We want flat walking trails for those who just want to be very visible and very easy walking, but there's also people who want to walk and hike a little more aggressive, a little more nature seen trails, and that was the desire and the draw to this property because it has that. For the past five years, the county has saved $1.6 million to go towards closing, with the remainder to be paid over seven years, starting September of next year. The, the previous fiscal court was very good about allocating money in our budget that's lined out. It's been there. We've been taking this money out already. Uh, it's already been there. We're not going to do any f physical, we, we have no physical changes for planning anything in the budget as far as spending any additional money at this moment. With no physical change in the budget, Judge Baker acknowledged that the realization of the park will be a multi-year project. This is going to be a multi-year thing. It's going to be an ever-evolving style park. I mean, it's not like we're going to walk in and immediately have everything built in a matter of days or weeks or even years. This is going to be a multi-evolving concept of a park. We're going to, it's going to be something that's going to build a little bit at a time until we get where we want. With the court's approval, Judge Baker and County Attorney Joe Ross are now authorized to finalize the contract, contingent on meeting specific conditions outlined by the court. So we'll have to get an appraisal to make sure the land uh, will appraise for what we are paying for it. So that would be contingency number one. The second one would be uh, environmental studies. We want to make sure that there's no archaeology uh, impact there or any uh, species of uh, trees or plants that we would be disturbing. The county is looking at closing on the purchase later this year. Reporting in Russellville, William Battle, WBKO News.